Voila! Your dream vacation to Turkey starts from Rs. 79,999 only with GT Holidays, South India's number one travel brand. Shobita's interpretation of love. Love is uh, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's a feeling of... Did you ever feel the pressure from your close ones? <clears throat> to get married? Yeah. No. But I did always think that uh, I, I'd always wanted ma the whole motherhood experience. I was very clear about it. And marriage, I, I did see myself getting married. I always saw myself in that setting. I always wanted Telugu ness to be a part of uh, moments like this because I'm very attached to my roots. Uh, very close to my parents. So this whole, the tradition aspect of it, I, I think that I kind of did fantasize about, like sweetly, not in, not like planning it, but like, I think that that is always there somewhere. But then you manifested it. That's what I'm going to say. <laughs> the perfect ingredient to a happy marriage. For me, it's humor. Moments of lightness. That That's what binds it together. It was quite relaxed, simple, sweet, uh, intimate and uh, warm mm, it was everything that i thought it would be sometimes we want to react out of like you know something happens and we want to react not really process it and respond but that's a very human thing i think it's okay yeah yeah and and i am an emotional person and i am very sensitive in telugu culture the the wedding has two saris one is lagnam sari which is like a silk sari, like a kanjivaram or something like that. It could be any color. And the second one is a standard white with a like a red border. Oh, lovely, lovely. Yeah. Congratulations to you! I will say so much. Badaiya, badaiya, badaiya. I happen to watch Love Sitara and I have to tell you that we are a group of five people sitting in the frame. One is happily married. Uh, one is about to get married. One claims that uh, settlement ho chuka hai <laughs> and there is one which you, you have made the film for who is hopelessly single I feel <laughs> thank you <laughs> for showing different facets of love in your film and I think through every character you have actually given a graph and an arc to every character and I like uh, before beginning I want to tell you that there is something that somebody will relate to any of the characters there could be something that of your character that I relate with and again something of your character that I relate with and something of yours but I think everybody the beauty of this movie is that everybody is going to have a different takeaway after the film ends so thank you so much for doing this for Galata thank India you. Thank, thank you so thank you. much for saying all that you yes. said yeah. I told her today that listen I think everybody is going to resonate with uh, the characters I enjoyed uh, how Sitara as a character plays out but she's an overthinker and very impulsive with her reactions as well, right? Yeah. She's assuming also a lot. Are you like that in real life? Like, would if something bothers you, would you like overthink it to the extent where you're actually getting more bothered than what you should be? I don't know. I mean, I've had people tell me that I am one. But to <laughs> me, I'm thinking. I'm not overthinking. <laughs> 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 that is what everybody would say. <laughs> I, I think we are all overthinkers. No? Are you an overthinker? No, no. Not at all. Continuous. The beauty of this is that um, there's a line, I'm not going to say where it comes, but the beauty is that it's the easiest and the most difficult to be happy, right? Yeah. That is what you have portrayed and it is so difficult sometimes to actually have a happy face being actors because if you're going through something, you can't even emote because you will easily get judged and judgment and shaming also is a part of the whole narrative that you have shown beautifully. I want to know as, as an actor, do you feel that sometimes... Because you guys are so much out there that your internal conflicts, emotions, which is very human on every level, um, you don't get to show it the way you would actually want it because you fear or that there will be trolling, there will be judgment, there will be criticism. Has that ever happened? I don't feel suffocated at all because uh, I, I enjoy the parallel journey. It's so nice to... Actually, uh, laymen would like to have this uh, life that they actually don't have to show what they are feeling. So uh, our days are divided into a life where we are portraying something else altogether. <laughs> That's true. That it you are is, not. It is so uh, relieving, so liberating and uh, you retire uh, at the end of the day as yourself. And then you have time to think that what am I feeling actually? 
because at times you are exhausted because you were doing a emotional scene or you were doing a funny sequence and something else was happening at the back end so uh, i quite enjoy that contradiction and it keeps me light because no problem weighs on me and uh, i don't become ecstatic either but have you always been like this no it took me time to uh, you know I, when i was i started working pretty young so there have been times where i have pleaded to the director like in ganesh utsav hai i can't be here in rajasthan shooting for a different i have to go home and they were like yeah but you have a commitment with us so to hell with the commitment i want to go for ganpati or there were my friends who were performing their play uh, for a competition and i was shooting for a film and i was telling the director if i don't cheer how will they perform <laughs> that's true and my director was like are you mad idhar mera scene chal raha hai shift khatam nahi hai tere cheering ka mere ko kuch lena dena nahi dosti pehle ha to i was crying and all i was howling ki kitne bure directors hai mujhe nahi chhoda i need to go and cheer my friends so it, it i mean i it uh, i spent a lot of time to learn this it has been a process but now i am one sadhu but what about you you can't lie because i know that there are phases where you also um feel a lot of things which you can't express because you know that there there's going to be a lot of like things that which actually gets to you how do you deal with those days or have you gone past that today whether actors or non actors i feel like we all try to keep our shit together no <laughs> i mean it's the same for anyone i mean i i don't think it's any different for my sister who's a doctor uh, sometimes we want to react out of Like you know, something happens and we want to react, not only really process it and respond, but that's a very human thing. I think it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, and and I am an emotional person, and I am very sensitive. I'm aware of it. I like those bits about myself. I think good comes of out of it. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, this is this is a beautiful ode to family. relationships friendships in a lot of ways like even the little little characters that you have in your like um, in your film they speak of friendships um how important is uh, family and relationships for you like as a person and relationships of every kind because love is love right mm. love comes from every corner like you said that you're seeking love from your mother as well sorry we can't say that um you're seeking love from your loved ones as well right and it's not just about partners so how would you define love and Whoever wants to start. What then? How would I? I think just love is that thing of free. Uh, what I think Rajiv keeps saying, the freedom to be. You know that that's when you really feel loved. You want to be seen and for who you are, and not be judged for who you are. That doesn't mean you will not be scolded when you do something wrong or told that you cannot talk to me. But you want to be. That's love, and and it starts. when you are this small so conditioning yeah yeah <laughs> i read somewhere that love is a necessary luxury ah nice luxury nahi hai actually no sorry but there are uh, uh, experiments done where you give a baby everything but no human contact mm. the baby dies wow we need, we are an animal that needs the nurture of another yeah. animal of our kind yeah mm. but yeah i I don't know. Yeah, I have different uh, interpretations of love on different days. Today's interpretation. Please go ahead. I want to. I want to. You know, I told you that you are gonna be fine oh, today. So you please tell me today's interpretation. <laughs> what do I say? But uh, what, what, on on what? Today, the twentieth of September. <laughs> Shobhita's interpretation love? of love. Love is uh, awesome. <laughs> uh, it's it's a feeling of. Uh, Okay, I, I in the most fundamental, simple way, um, I think there is a certain. You know, I don't know what it's like to go back into a womb, but I can imagine what that feels like. That's what I think of love as. It could be a lover, it could be a parent, it could be a habit, it could be a vice, it could be whatever it is. Something that that. I think that's love. Very deep. <laughs> I love it what you said. But that should be an interpretation every day which is which is great. I wish I was so wise you know? <laughs> <laughs> on different days. Yeah. What about you? Will you tell uh, people that you found love or not found love and then start? 
Maybe, maybe. Yeah. But the whole thing is, for me, love is what How the. How badmash you were. Yeah. Maybe he's saying. Yeah. Yes, I have. Ah. Yes. <laughs> See, we made him confess. Committed. <laughs> but I feel uh, again, uh, love is, and I think you talk about friendships as well, right? Yes. I think anybody in whose presence I can be at ease. That. मतलब भाई and again I have, I'm sorry I'm just harping about non-judgment and non just 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 जिसके साथ में I can just be I don't need to like I think that's why uh, sometimes with close friendships or close relationships you both don't need to speak a word yeah you just are तो मेरे हिसाब से वो वही है यार जब आपको you know you can just be But you know, there's when you talk about judgment, there's such a beautiful, there are such beautiful lines that you've drawn when it comes to shaming, not going overboard, right? I want to ask everyone, especially like you guys, and then coming to you also. Um, I feel that a woman gets judged uh, if they are not married beyond a certain age, and um, like I said, that more than the societal judgment, the societal judgment is so much that eventually. you start judging yourself because you start believing in the noise around because that noise is too much do you feel that a single woman like um you in the film they're always um labeled a little difficult a little more demanding even if they demand for something as basic as love and respect and weird so i feel the pressure is more from the family than uh, your colleagues or friends uh family always feels that settling down is important i have been a single person for the longest in my life and i was always a happy single person i wasn't sure whether i'll find anyone to get married to uh, but i always wanted to be a mother but my i never felt angry about what relatives were saying for example my maasi mama aunts their expectation is you know you should have a partner the the pressure wasn't about iski shaadi kab hogi it was more about my happiness that you deserve that happiness which was very cute and i have i have had my moments of feeling choked that how can they feel so much for me and that was beautiful i don't think uh, as long as you are confident society is us uh, society is what you project so uh, project yourself as so no neighbors uh, or uh, workmates have given me that pressure of are tu akeli hai ha huh? and then unki nazar badal jati hai no i was always independent i was earning well for myself i was successful so um, i think uh, i like the way um, i was leading my own life so there was no complex in my mind if you have complex about if you feel hesitant about like hema is somewhere very unsure yeah. about her status yeah. so then you have to give it to her that she is getting what she is asking for if you don't ask for it society gives you immense love and family to definitely stands for you what about you no but i did always think that uh, i uh, I I'd always wanted ma- the whole motherhood experience I was very clear about it and marriage I I did see myself getting married I always saw myself in that setting But yeah everybody has an idea of a happy marriage like while growing up only you feel you look at films and you feel like jab main shaadi karunga ya karungi to aise hona chahiye ya main ye karunga is pe I to feel like doing uh, dance at everybody else's shaadi also that's a different story kyunki ab क्या करे सब की बारातें आई दैट्स बट आई वांट टू नो दैट डिड यू हैव लाइक अ वाइल ग्रोइंग अप डिड यू हैव एन आइडिया ऑफ लाइक दिस इज हाउ आई एम गोना गेट मैरिड आई ऑलवेज वांटेड तेलुगु नेस टू बी अ पार्ट ऑफ मोमेंट्स लाइक दिस बिकॉज आई एम वेरी अटैच्ड टू माय रूट्स वेरी क्लोज टू माय पेरेंट्स सो दिस होल द ट्रेडिशन एस्पेक्ट ऑफ इज आई थिंक दैट आई काइंड ऑफ did fantasize about like sweetly not in not like planning it but like i think that that is always there somewhere but then you manifested it that's what i'm going to say <laughs> what about you uh, what about did you have like an idea of like this is where, how i got, want to get married of course of course and then wh- i met uh, one of my very close friends her parents i saw and they've been must have been married for 30 years 35 years 
and they the you know the joy they just uh, had interacting with each other every single day was just immense and pehli baar unke bete ki shaadi pe i just saw everybody just i don't so i didn't see any stressed person everybody was generally just jumping with joy and i was yeah. like yaar agar shaadi ho to aise ho bhai koi stress na kare you know ki ye nahi ho raha time nahi bhai ye khushi ka avsar hai it should be just like with joy yeah and let things go wrong it's fine but it's okay it it will definitely go wrong zahir si baat hai na bas matlab the, the couple is happy and it's the most important of the life they should not be stressed because often you see people stressed and i'm like bhai nahi nahi shaadi ho to aise ho everybody is just like having a blast absolutely what about you shaadi not as a ceremony but i really like the way my parents deal with each other till date <laughs> that's true they it's it's so cute and uh, they uh, my father sings and uh, my mom says that are bap re ye abhi my father feels emotional when he starts singing and he generally <laughs> sings in <laughs> it's so sweet i mean he sings uh, desh bhakti wale gaane so he starts balasagar bharat and the second word itself he is completely teary so my mother is like oh my god now it starts and the way she reacts but she wants him to sing <laughs> that's true that, that so and sweet. and that's so sweet they used to that and my father never likes the way she, i make shira he likes her shira whenever he is having dal he said aap log dal banate ho hamari aunty bahut achhi hoti hai so i am like are yaar aap kabhi to try karo na abhi 60 saal se unke haath se hi khana kha rahe ho but it is so cute that they they need each other yeah. and the way i at at times i say that i please yaar इतना तो कर लो एंड बाबा सेड नहीं उनको अभी नहीं अच्छा लगता है ना वो फूलों वाला दुपट सम ड्रेस आई हेड बॉट एंड माय मॉम सेड टू मच डिजाइन ऐसे अरे ठीक है ना अभी कॉटन का चाहिए था सादा चाहिए था अभी दुपट्टे पे डिजाइन है बट फादर स्टूड बाय हर एंड ही सेड बाबा सेड बट शी डजेंट लाइक डिजाइन सो आई जस्ट फील दैट इट इज सो नाइस दैट यू वॉन्ट टू स्टैंड बाय योर पार्टनर एंड you know your ailments your likes dislikes everything you're together yeah you have your differences but you want to hold hands yeah. that's something which is unparalleled for me it's so cute yeah. and this is something that i feel that today's generation lacks which is also possibly why i'm hopelessly single because i think i'm stuck in time and i feel that do you feel like the conflicts that you guys have shown from the very first scene like there's a weird proposal it happens all of a sudden do you feel like that conflict is there genuinely with this generation like when we have grown up do you feel like or we are also a cusp right we have seen like this dating generation and like all going kuchi ku and aaj to attachment ke naam pe kuch alag hi ho raha hai but do you feel that strongly that this generation has that conflict when it comes to love especially i want to ask both of you can't speak for my generation i've 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 known love when i felt it Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll use that line as well. <laughs> wow, I'm just being a nice friend and not saying anything to you. You know that, na? You know that, na? That I'm not saying anything to you just because I'm being a very diligent friend. Hmm. What about you, ma'am? I want to tell you something. <laughs> yes. Ma'am, don't say anything. Don't say anything. Okay, let's go. Don't be so senior. No, yeah. So, listen. Okay. I have an advice for you. Now I'm taking the seniority. You take risk. You fall in love. What will happen? You will fail, na? I ended up as Hema. Do you realize that? <laughs> <laughs> I just told you. I was literally told that oh, this relationship cannot have a name. I might get married, but oh, you are there. No. अब मैं कुछ और बोलने वाला था जो कट जाएगा, but I will tell you post. हाँ, ठीक है. But I bless you कि uh, all these uh, exercises, experiences, they really help you. So take a plunge. There is no harm in uh, yeah. failing, and no harm in you know saying that the other person loves you more, and you need to learn how to love. No, I don't. I, I have a I have a basic uh, understanding of myself, and I've realized that this is why I'm gonna change in the next two years. And I don't know why I'm saying this out aloud, uh, but. Um, <laughs> I think I've always over loved and over given in any relationship not mm. not romantic relationship in any relationship except my mother I think I over love and over given every relationship Mujhe lagta hai and now I should stop uh, we are uh, mele mein bichde hue bhai behan <laughs> to uh, 
always remember that I used to feel that for the longest time till I met my husband Nachiket. And don't don't mislead yourself that you know somebody feels protective about you. That caring you should allow other pe person to uh, shower, to take care of you because you are so self sufficient that you feel that. I am loving so much, but you are not allowing the other person to love you that much. So uh, try that, uh, and we can have an independent conversation <laughs> about what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can teach you a little a, bit. अपनी अच्छाई मत छोड़िएगा. That's all. It's one of the nicest things about Absolutely. you. Absolutely. Your your ability to give and be so warm. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. Now that you said that, um, what do you think uh, is the perfect element of a happy relationship, like a happy romantic relationship or a happy marriage? What do you think holds it? Like we were discussing about parents, right? But in our generation, in your life especially, what do you think is the perfect ingredient to a happy marriage? For me, it's humor, moments of lightness. That that's what binds it together. And uh, a lot of people don't know this, and maybe they know, but you are very, very funny because your one-liners are like. Really? Yeah, yeah. You uh, have you? Should we read our chats no. sometimes? Ah, thank you. <laughs> I think it is food and caring. <laughs> oh, lovely! Ha, huh, food. I I love cooking for my husband. I uh, I think I am a good cook, and uh, yeah, that that is how I this. can express my love. He and he enjoys what I uh, have made. and he cares so much for me i feel very nice how sweet communication communication matlab phone karte ho ek dusre wo to karna hi padta hai but uh, <laughs> but communication na could be informed no 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 or what i mean is ki slightly wo ki if something is bothering you speak up because holding on to something and then baad mein badhas nikalna is also so i think just being communi communicative you know like he said what is What what do you think when you introspect? What is your biggest or the most difficult trait about you in any relationship? Like, what is it that people have to tolerate about you if they are actually with you? <laughs> I have a list. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when uh, eccentricity, uh, OCDs, I think. You you are eccentric. Well, OCDs. OCD. About and I guess when I start working on something like on a project, then I get extremely obsessive about it. to the point where i'm just like obsessed so much that sometimes i may uh, not be aware ki there are other people around in this and may not be communicative enough that's why i'm learning from that what about you i mean i can think of what i want to improve on in, in myself but from the lens of another person i don't know what they what do you think you should improve on so many things like a अपने में होता ना कि अरे मैं ये करती हूँ मुझे लगता है की I live in my own shell, so I think I tend to be a bit of a hermit, uh, which is not always a good thing, uh, because I, I it, it's at odds with what I do at work. So there's a little bit of a khichdi there, and I think I should I should work on my discipline because I have none. It's I, I'm I'm led by passion, not by duty, which sometimes can be magical, but uh, it's difficult to be consistent. So that is something how, I like. But how like how is it a problem for somebody who is with you? Like if if you're like that's what I said. I know what I can improve on. Things about me, from the lens of another person, maybe what I don't like about myself is something they really adore. So why should I judge for them? Oh, lovely. What about you? That's a good thing. Yeah, yeah. I think I uh, always want to do too many things in a day, and it is difficult for one person to be doing ten th ten <laughs> things in one day. so i have Madurga. to ha huh, matlab it is i don't have 10 hands na so i have to tell myself because i am everywhere i am telling my team what is to be done attending to my daughter telling nachiket ki kya kar sakte hain aage aane wale weekend ko i do too many things and i am shooting i am dubbing and then i have a meeting so i i can uh, you know minimize my tasks it's too much and for the other person it might be overwhelming that oh my god what all she is doing and where do i fit in in this yeah. so i better 
reduce it. So the last few times we have met, uh, our, we couldn't officially uh, speak about it on camera, but today we can officially congratulate you because you've just gotten engaged. Uh, so Vita, I just want to tell you that the post that you had uh, put up, um, mm. it was so beautiful, it was so poetic. Um, it was a moment where you as a person go through so many emotions, right? Because it's it's possibly one of the most beautiful moments of your life. Um, what was the actual feeling that you had? Um, and did it match the feeling that you had while you said that I had a, I had expected or I dreamt of a particular way that things would be? Did it match it? I don't think I went into the moment with a lot of expectations or uh, mm, dreams. Plan. No, I think I was there. It was quite relaxed, simple, sweet, uh, intimate and uh, warm. Mm, it was everything that I thought it would be. Much like Sitara because you know when I saw the uh, uh, film and uh, there's the discussion that where are you going to get married and mm. she decides that no, I'm going to do this here and even if her parents are suggesting that let's do it here, let's do it yeah, that, yeah. you're extremely rooted that when that is exactly how you have also done in your real life was that always the plan to make it more like I think wanting to do things it, there's this quote by Hemingway he said uh, someday I will find the right words and they will be simple I think with life also I think uh, when when beautiful things happen I don't need them I don't I don't feel the need for embellishments that moment itself fills me so uh, it was I didn't feel like oh I, it was simple or oh it was not I, I don't it was what it was meant to be and it was perfect. It was beautiful. Thank you. Let's not call it simple. Those are not the words. Beautiful, it was just yeah. beautiful. Thank and you. that's everybody who has known you, who have not known you, also would feel the same amount of happiness seeing Very what you did. That's so sweet. Thank you. Absolutely. What is your take on the same? I love the the vibrancy of, of you know, like because it's interesting how when you look at some, say, some photographs of some wedding from the past, you could tell, "Acha, ye yahan ke hain, inka ye culture hai, ya this must be the roots." Oh, this jewelry looks like it's from Sindh. Like you, you could piece together a story of their yeah. heritage of their. That I thought was very interesting, very beautiful. Um, yeah, so I, I'm not a minimal type person. I mean, that could be a mood or a certain kind of a look for some day. But I think these occasions which are uh, mm, ceremonial, I like the full fervor. But there is, a, like I said that there for Bengalis, there is a, yeah. th there, there must be something that you guys also follow, like as a uh, part of it. In, do itinerary, they do abhi haan, wohi, main aapko memo <laughs> <bhez> deti <hu. laughs> haan, email. Hmm. Uh, no, in Telugu culture, the, the wedding has two saris. One is Lagnam sari, which is like a silk sari, like a Kanjivaram or something like that. It could be any color. And the second one is a standard white with a like a red border. Oh, lovely. Yate, yate, I want to ask because this also talks about things that you tolerate and you don't tolerate in any relationship. What is it that is a deal breaker for you um, in any relationship that you have had? I have no deal breakers. I'm okay to take rejection. <laughs> I mean, if the other person is not willing to be with me, I'm okay with it. I'm ready to take it because that person may have not necessarily in the uh, marriage, but in any uh, bond. If the other person is done with my bond, I'm okay with it. I'll set that person free. Yeah. I don't want to fight with that uh, or I don't want to take it as a defeat. I'm okay with it. Okay. I can't feel good at all. Yeah, you were saying something? No, that I, I, I don't think I can uh, look at a, a relationship of any kind. But like, if this is this, then approved. If this is this, then cancel. I, say, I don't know. I don't think that's the way I approach emotion or relationships. Not just romantic. I mean, no, like, I'm talking about any, any relationship. Yeah, any even, relationship. Even friendship. Even friendships, absolutely. There should be the, the, that room na, to, to experience it's a spectrum, no? All emotions. Sometimes you're you're very happy because of someone. Sometimes you're wronged. So, so many things we feel. All those things, and, and that's what gives that density and richness to a relationship. And you're able to go through the motions. So I, by having this idea that okay, if someone does this or says this, it's not cool. In a relationship, I'm saying I. That's not my approach. 
there could be some days when I'll be completely thrown off by certain things, but I don't think I will go into it like hmm, judgment. I don't think that will work. No, out. I'm saying like uh, in any relationship, hmm. I wouldn't tolerate disrespect. Like I don't like people disrespecting. Like even if they don't matter to me, if I see a person disrespecting anybody in the room, then I'll feel like I don't want to. Speak to this person because I feel that he or she is very disrespectful that way. Like disrespect is a very it can be grey sometimes, you know, because interpretations are very different. Yeah, yeah. What is it that is a deal breaker for you? Uh, none per se because like now, now you talk about disrespect. For instance, up. A relationship me kisi ke saath jayenge hi nahi ya waisi friendships nahi banayenge if you have genuine friendships. जहाँ पर आप जानते हैं कि दी अदर पर्सन इज द काइंड डिसरिस्पेक्ट समबडी यू नो फॉर द हेल्प ऑफ इट सो इन दैट सेंस आई डोंट थिंक एनी पर्टिकुलर डील अगेन लाइक एज शोबित सेट यू नो इट्स मोर नुआंस देन जस्ट कि अच्छा ये पॉइंट है ये पॉइंट है अगर ये पॉइंट है तो डील ब्रेक है ऐसा नहीं होता इट्स लाइक मुझे झूठ समझ नहीं आता है सो इट फोक्सिस मी इट शिक्स मी आप सो झूठ इज अट डजेंट मीन आई वॉन्ट फॉर गिव आई जस्ट सेट आई मोस्ट लाइक हिम but it really rattles me yeah i agree even i can't like i you don't comfort me with a lie just just i'll deal my with, head the with the truth, truth. It's yeah fine. i'll also it's deal fine. with the truth <laughs> and yeah. truth bol ke kuch bhi kar lo par batao such such and then mm. we'll talk about it absolutely but kudos to you uh for making a film like this kudos to everybody who's backed uh, a movie like this and kudos to everybody who's part of uh, this as well i hope that this reaches out to many who are finding love who are in love and uh, yeah to everybody who's uh, happily married who are going to get married who have found love and who are yet to find love <laughs> so thank you so much and congratulations to you jati jati itna to bolunga badhaiya 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 hi i'm sobita dhulepala hi i'm sonali kulkarni and we are the cast of Love Sitara, and you're watching us on Galata India. Galata India. Galata India. Galata. Oh la! Your dream vacation to Turkey starts from rupees seventy nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine only with GT Holidays, South India's number one travel brand.